Hi everybody, this is Tina. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to the House Most Collaboration 2019. This is the final video for December. Um, we had a year-long collaboration with myself and an, about five or six other lovely ladies and um, we were sharing our House Mouse projects on the third Saturday of every month all throughout the year and today is uh, December 21st and this is the last one. Um, that doesn't mean that um, I'm going to stop decorating with House Mouse because I will continue to do that um, and I will continue to share my projects on YouTube but it just won't be in a collaboration. Okay, um, there will be a giveaway attached to this video and I am not going to uh, put any rules or um, anything that you have to do. I don't want you to have to send something in or anything like that. I just want you to um, go back to my playlist. It's at the on my homepage of my YouTube channel and um, go down through and watch all the house mouse collaboration videos that I had posted and leave a comment on each and every one of those videos and then you will be entered into the giveaway. Now I'm not going to draw the winners until after probably not until after the new year that will give me time to go back through the videos and um, write everybody's names down. It will also give you guys a chance to go back and watch all of the videos because um, including this one, there are 12 videos, okay? So, um, yeah, I think so. I think there are 12. Um, but there might be an a introduction video. You don't have to watch that one if you don't want. But um, just the from January to December, uh, just go back and watch those videos, okay? All right, and leave a comment. That's very important to leave a comment. And then I'm going to give, uh, probably give away, um, I am giving away House Mouse um, stamps for the prize. Just depends on um, how many people follow the rules and uh, whether or not you already have the house mouse stamps that I'm offering. So what I'm going to do is I have a box of house mouse stamps and I am going to separate them into prizes. Um, now there could be up to three prizes and um, I will leave some extras on the side. This way, um, if you win, say you win the first prize and um, there are some stamps in that first prize that are actually... Um, you already have so you can contact me tell me that you're the winner and then also um, ask to exchange and I will tell you what I have other than the ones you have and you can pick okay to see if there's something that you don't have and we can swap out so that's how that's what my plan is and that's how I want to do it um, but like I said it's important you have to comment on every one of those videos in my playlist now, that doesn't mean that you have to go to each and every one of the ladies to and, and comment. I'm not doing that because that's just so much. Unless you have been already following throughout the year, that's just a lot for someone to do, especially around Christmas and the holidays. I know how everybody's busy, so that's why I'm giving you a chance. Um, you can watch a couple videos on your own time whenever you feel up to it whenever you have a couple extra seconds which I know right now is kind of um you know you don't really don't have time because of the holidays I understand that and like I said that's why I'm gonna wait to after the first year to draw the winners that's giving you a chance all right so let's get started with this um this month's collaboration video and like I said this is the last one and I want to share with you first of all the stamps that I picked out to use on my projects today and the first one is this one here which is called um, nestled in bed so I did um, mostly Christmas related stamps this month because it is December and so we have the cute little three little mice in inside a dresser drawer with their stockings hung and a little candle next to them. So adorable, super cute. So I picked that stamp for this month. I also picked this stamp this month, which was called Candy Cane Kiss. 
I thought that was actually all, um, perfect as well. And I also picked this stamp set, which is called um, Carrying Mints. So those are the three stamps that I use for my projects. These are just a few dies that I used. I used my Gina Marie uh, Rectangle Cross Stitch die. Um, I used uh, Merry Christmas, this one here, Merry Christmas, and I think I used um, this this one here, this Merry Christmas. So I used those two sentiments. These uh, Merry Christmas stamps are from Allie. And then um, this is a Gina Marie Scallop Stitch Square, and I also used this die as well. Okay. So those are the dies and the stamps that I use this month for my cards. And so let's get started and I'll share the cards with you. So this is the first one. I thought this little mouse was adorable holding all those little candy mints. And um, I used some paper from, let's see, I have some over here. I had some scraps left over from this paper, which was, I believe, a... Uh, I think this was a doodle bug paper. I'm not 100%. Hold on. I think I have the cover here because it was empty. Yes, this was a doodle bug paper called Home for the Holidays. Okay. So you can see the peppermints right here in this paper pad that I used. Um, and a couple other papers from this paper stack that I used um, on this card. And I also used um, this paper pad, which was on another card that I did was, oh, what fun. This was the My Mind's Eye we got from Tuesday morning. So, but back to this. So here's, um, I laid a red layer down, the peppermint candy layer. Here's the Merry Christmas, which I put glitter on. And here's that stitch scalloped uh, square colored with Copics. And I added uh, stickles to the mints and I'm not sure you guys are picking that up hopefully you can see the glitter it's really pretty and it makes in person the card looks really really cute and then here's the inside I just brought over that candy mint paper into the inside and then a spot for you to write your message and I always signed the back of the cards with my stamp so that's the first card that I did um, and then I did this card, which was with the two little candy kiss. And the papers in this pad came from the Oh What Fun. Um, I used the polka dot paper here. And then the candy canes, which is not being shown. Oh, yeah, here. The candy canes and the polka dots is what I used on this one. And I did a diagonal piece here for the polka dots and then the candy canes and I did the candy canes of course because the mice are inside the candy canes I love this stamp this stamp is so cute and then I used another stitch scallop square and the other Merry Christmas sentiment I showed you um, on this one I put stickles on the Merry Christmas and also on the candy canes and then here's the inside and basically, I just used the same papers, the scraps, and I cut them diagonal and um, put them inside with a spot to write your, your uh, message. And, of course, I signed the back. So that is the second card. And then the third card is this one here with the three snuggled in bed waiting on Santa to fill their stockings. So, so super cute. And so the background paper on this was from the doodle bug paper. It's the green with, um, it actually is right here, the piece that's left. It has poinsettias on it. And um, I used that in the background uh, with my stitched or uh, cross stitched rectangle. Um, and then I colored in with Copics. And then these little flowers came from a little ephemera pack that I picked up from Tuesday morning, probably last year. But that's this card here. And then the inside of this card has um, basically the same paper and a place for you to write. Now, I might put a sentiment on the inside, seeing that the outside of this does not have a sentiment. 
I might do a stamp that just says Merry Christmas in the inside because um, it is kind of plain. So that's that one. So real quick, I'll just bring it up so you can see it again. That is that one. And this one. And this one. So I hope you enjoyed the House Mouse collaboration throughout the year. It has been lots of fun for me. Um, I just have to um, move on to different things. I am now uh, a DT and I'm working for two different um, stores. One is the Surprise Creation Store, which is on AliExpress. And then the In Love Art Shop, which is another store. But they're not on AliExpress. They're just another store that has stamps and dies. And... Um, so with those two stores in mind, I am very busy trying to use up the dies that they send me and create projects. And I also want to um, expand my card making into other different things this year. Um, you know, maybe make a couple 3D dimensional projects, um, more shakers, um, some pocket letters, and maybe a stuffed envelope here and there or something like that. But I want to do other things and I have kind of like a an idea where I want to bring my channel. So, um, like I said, it has been so much fun with the house mouse collaboration and, but I will not be continuing it next year. Now, I don't know if anybody else will pick it up, um, or maybe they will start their own collaboration with house mouse because I know there are lots of you out there that love house mouse as much as I do. And, um, but like I said, I will still be creating with these stamps because I have, tons of them and I don't want them to just sit. So I will be continuing to work with these house mouse stamps and I will show you the projects as I use my stamps. And um, hopefully you come back to see those projects. I wanna wish everybody a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Um, God bless. Thank you all so much for all the support you have given me and the other collaborators and the ladies. And um, thank you for watching my channel all the time, leaving thumbs up and great messages. I always read the messages and I always try to respond. Um, but again, you know, it's, it's time. If I have the time to respond, I will. Um, I try to, I try to do that because I feel that, um, you take the time out to watch my video and you leave a comment. So in turn, I read your comment and I like to respond to you, letting you know that I appreciate you watching and I appreciate you leaving a comment. So um, if we can keep that up for the next year, it'll be awesome. And uh, all right, you guys, I'm going to let you go because I'm chit chatting too much. <laughs> I hope, like I said, I hope you all have a Merry Christmas and we will see you in the next video. Bye.